RSS Chief Mohan Bhagwat, who's been meeting Muslim leaders in an unprecedented outreach, visited a mosque in Delhi and held a meeting today with Omar Ahmed Ilyasi, the chief cleric of the All India Imam organization. He also later visited a madrasa and interacted with students there. जो इलियासी साहब है उन्होंने बहुत दिन पहले पूजनीय सरसंघ चालक जी से मिलकर निमंत्रण दिया था वो बहुत दिन से पेंडिंग था और इसीलिए उनके निमंत्रण को स्वीकार करते हुए वो उनसे मिलने गए थे और ये संघ के पूजनीय सरसंघ चालक समाज जीवन के सभी प्रकार के लोगों से मिलते रहते हैं और एक संवाद की जो सामान्य प्रक्रिया सतत संघ के द्वारा चलाई चलती रहती है उसी का एक हिस्सा है यह all right, Akhilesh joining us with the latest on that. Uh, Akhilesh, you know, this obviously seems to be a part of a larger outreach, but specifically today, uh, a very strong message going from the cleric concerned also who uh, described uh, the RSS chief as Rashtrapita and said this was sending out a good message. That's right. In fact, uh, this was very interesting meeting uh, because uh, he, as you just heard uh, Sunil Ambeka saying that this was sought a year ago and it was pending since then. And today, Mohan Bhagwat actually went to visit the residence of the chief of All India Imam Conference and that residence happened to be inside a mosque. So the impression went out that Mr. Mohan Bhagwat has actually visited the mosque. But in fact, he has gone to meet uh, the Imam at his residence. Anyways, uh, they had a very long discussion there. And in that discussion, Mr. Uh, Bhagavad was told that there are various uh, concerns being raised about madrasas. So why not he go and check? what happens inside the madrasa exactly. So this institute also runs a madrasa. So Mr. Bhagwat went to that madrasa and he interacted with the students there. He asked them uh, very various questions including why aren't you reading only Quran and why don't you read Gita also. And apart from that, in which country do you live? How do you know this country? Do you call it India, Hindustan or Bharat? So these kind of questions were asked by Mr. Mohan Bhagwat to all these students. And in fact, we know that uh, the madrasas are making political headlines because BJP ruled Assam. It had taken action against these madrasas. Now the UP government is mm -hmm. conducting surveys in madrasas. So in that context, this uh, visit becomes very interesting. Right. Akhilesh, also, you know, given that uh, we're now seeing that these visits have pretty much been happening, or rather talks have been happening uh, for, for, for over a month now, and, and really there's a larger background context to all of this. So uh, if you could uh, remind us uh, of a few details of the kind of conversations uh, Mr. Bhagwat has already had with Muslim uh, thought leaders. Well, this meeting you are referring to, Ankit, it happened in August where five intellectuals they had gone to meet Mr. Bhagwat. They raised various kind of questions and the kind of mistrust in the atmosphere which is uh, present in the current scenario. They discussed that thing also and Mr. Bhagwat of course tried to address all those concerns. So this was kind of a conversation and RSS sources are telling me that this conversation is an ongoing process. It's a long term view. It does not happen keeping the current political situation in mind. But of course it raises sev several questions because we know that in 2025 RSS will be completing 100 years of establishment. So before that RSS is trying to reach out to all the Muslim intellectuals and this also raises a question Ankita whether the RSS and the BJP trying to, you know, uh, trying to project a moderate Muslim leadership in the country because we know that people like Asaduddin Ovesi, they are known to be hardliners and they try to speak on each and every issue concerning Muslims. So the so self-proclaimed spokesperson apart uh, uh, is the BJP also trying to uh, project another kind of leadership, a moderate leadership in the Muslims. That's another question.